Hello to everyone, this is Joanna, and today I went back to Bath & Body Works, but I wanted to share a couple of things with you first. I found some of these at Schnucks today, which is great because these are the disposable Kleenex wet wipes that I really do like. And then I also went to Walgreens. I picked up two lip liners. I wanted the one called Mason. I should have got it when I seen it because these were gone when I went back. These were $4 a piece, and they were buy one, get one at half price. So I got one matte lip liner in the shade Club Hopper, which is this one. And then I got this other one in the shade Espresso. They're not that much far off, but I got these to go under my um, Fenty liners and I just needed some dark lip liners. I like my MAC Chestnut and Cork, but I think they're drying out. And then of course I had to get this candy bar, which I'm probably gonna be dipping into here along the way. Now, of course I went to Bath & Body Works. Y'all know that I have to go back. What did I go back out there for? I went back out there to get the rest of the collection that this is from. And while I was out there, I'm eating frozen chocolate. I decided to go ahead and ask them about the beads. I also got this right here. This is gone, so it cannot make an appearance in the video because I ate it. I was trying to see if I had any of this stuff near me. I should. So I'm going to adjust my phone. So, I called back because I couldn't be without this. You guys know that I said that I had the 16-ounce 2-in-1, um, but I still had to get this. They were buy two, get one free still. So I went ahead and I got the Crystal Rose. Is that right? Crystal Candy Rose. So I now have all of these. I believe I have, is it five of them? I have all five now. I have the Crystal Candy Rose, the Vanilla Bean Noel, the Lemon Snowdrop, the Blueberry, and the lavender sugar so i'm very happy that i have all of these now i asked them if they had the bath salts by any chance and they said the only one they had is blueberry i believe they let me buy this one because they have been showing this one now these are smaller than the previous bath salts have been as we all know these are 14 dollars and 50 cents and the ones from a couple summers ago that were just two dollars more these restore these were a 17 ounce bottle compared to what this little bottle is today now if these came in this size oh my but it's okay these little things smell so good this was the first one that they let us smell and you've heard me say this is reminiscent of the blueberry products that they had when um my daughter and my son were into the blueberry hand soap came out with her she's 10 years older than him but i want all of these as well even the one that is the crystal rose and if i get a second set it will most likely be this blueberry so i now have one complete set as you know this is coming out in body care we already know for a fact it's coming out in cream we don't know um, if it comes out in the shower gel. I hope it does, and I hope it doesn't come out in what they tried to copy off the Lush shower jelly. I hope that this comes because I definitely want this in the cream once I smell the bath salt. So I do have one complete set, and I have four more to go. And, of course, I got my free item here, and we know I'm not going to be keeping this. I'm going to be exchanging this for a piece of the new line, Mary Cookie, Blueberry, what have you. And this one, I wanted to try the sage one and this one and this one one out. I do not have the shower gel to this and I probably won't get it. I will probably use my unscented um, body wash. This is the Juniper and Coriander Body Cream. And it's got the Juniper Oil to stimulate positivity and mental clarity and Coriander Oil to help regulate emotions. We'll see how this works. I need to be using these, but I love this packaging. I love this night packaging right here. I have nail stamping plates with that kind of design on it. The next thing that I got was, y'all know that I was going back after this. This was my exchange for the Into the Night 
creamy wash and I'm hoping that since they're coming out with all these creamy washes and they have the men's stuff in creamy wash now I think that is fantastic if y'all see that pick it up I'm very glad that they have that I'm hoping that if they come back out with the gingerbread latte which they are they will make that into a shower cream that would be fantastic so of course I had to get this one right here in the creamy wash and the last thing I got and y'all know it was coming I had to get this pink fairy gumdrop I could not let it go and I got this lid on it right here because I also could not let that go I will be returning for the Mary cookie and the chocolate lava and what else is in this line I think it was Mary cookie the chocolate lava I'm gonna get the pumpkin cinnamon swirl whatever that one is in the other packaging maybe I think I like it in that packaging better. I don't know, but I plan on getting the mint ones. Maybe not the peppermint marshmallow. I have a couple of those around here. Maybe the one that smells like Andy's mints. But for sure, I want another one of these and a couple of Mary cookies, another vanilla bean, and I definitely want the caramel drizzle. This right here smells so good. It kind of smells candy-like. This is Pink Fairy Gumdrop, and I hope that it burns nice because everybody loved the bubble gum, and then it didn't burn nice, and I don't know how it did the second time. Mine was a flop. I did not like it burning. I had two of them. I ended up taking one back. So Pink Fairy Gumdrop is sparkling sugared berries, pink cotton candy, sprinkle of fairy dust, and they all say with essential oils, but this is a beautiful candle. And y'all know without a sale, they are $24.50. So we're all waiting for candle day. We're also all waiting for a candle sale. I do have the sugar snickerdoodle, but I would like to try it in this form. And I also want to get the gingerbread latte. And I haven't done any reviews on any candles because I watch reviews. But I will be coming back to do my first Falls Winter Burn series for this season. To share with you what I have burned so far for the candles that I am collecting that I'm trying to dwindle down so this is the last thing that I got right here I do want some more hand creams and I am holding out for the rest of this sweet shop collection I am very happy that I have my first set right here and then I will be getting the scents to the rest of these and these smell so good my favorite two from this line of course are the lavender sugar and the blueberry my least favorite from the line oddly enough is this lemon because it's not buttercream this really smells like the milk and honey formula from the aromatherapy line I'm not disappointed I'm still gonna get the set but I'll probably maybe just get the body cream in this if the cream doesn't smell the way I want it to I'll just get the cream in this but I don't know do you guys know if they're coming out with a lavender sugar do you think they are because I didn't know that and then of course the crystal rose I don't know why I dislike this scent I don't think that it smells bad did y'all see the mess I just made I don't think that it smells bad I just don't care for the scent that much but I'm gonna go ahead and still get whatever I can get in this maybe possibly a cream in this just for this set everything else though i want the wash the mist the cream especially that mary cookie so yeah and this vanilla bean this one was the one a lot of people went after but i think that blueberry packs the most fragrance and the lavender sugar but that's all that i got guys i have worked um they had me work yesterday 12 hour shift 6a to 6p and then I actually worked yesterday night until this morning. I have been up ever since. So it's time for a shower and bed. And it's almost 7 p.m. So I know I'm going to sleep till in the morning when my work actually starts. I did my manicure again, but I'm at that stage where I need to let some hand washing and soaking take over. But I try to do something more intricate. Y'all have heard me say that shorter nails call for a more intricate design or even dark nail polish if they are damaged. And I'm going to put all of this stuff up. But that is it. Until the next time, everyone have a great evening.